Hey guys, uh, how how are you? Uh, this is your boy, uh, Ralph Kelly. Uh, welcome to another video. And so today it's an episode, you know, the Tunnel Tunnel Vision series. If you haven't watched my previous video, just watch it. Uh, but basically today we want to talk about what Mike Tyson said. Um, in, a, in an interview. So basically he had an interview with uh, Francis Ngano or Nango or Ngano. Uh, he's a, he was a he's a former UFC fighter. He's I think he's at the PFA or whatever they call it now. Um, so Mike Tyson was having an interview or a chat with him. And so in that he asked him uh, like what is the what is the best advice you've ever gotten? And uh, this is what he said. He said, and I think I'll show the clip later, but I'll say it myself. Uh, he says something like this. Too soon old, too late smart. Too soon old, too late smart. Um, a lot of people have fallen victim to the results of this saying. Too soon old, too late smart. You get smarter or you realize certain things that should, you should have done when you're younger. But the thing is now you're older, so you can't really do that. You know, if you look at uh, sports, for example, haven't you ever sit in with, your, with an uncle, with a family member who's like in their 40s, and they're telling you how good they used to be at football? Oh, I used to be so great, I would dribble the whole thing. And then the uncle is like, ah, yeah, this guy, this guy should have played for South Africa. What happened there? What happened there? If it was that thing, too soon old, too late smart happened to them. They did not seize the, uh, the chance. They did not run with the vision. They did not run with the goal. They just left it like that. So guys, I believe that a lot of us, we are still young, although... For me, even though I'm in my 20s um, now, I haven't crossed the 25 border yet, so I, I still have it. Um, but I feel very old. You know, this is the time, guys. We have to carry the baton. We have to carry. We have to carry the baton of greatness. We have to run with the vision, with the goal. Because you may fall victim of the results of too soon old too late smart so guys that's my message for today you know let's not waste time let's not waste time in life or when a person is sleeping on their deathbed, uh, deathbed or hospital bed rather I heard this from Prophet Uberenjo he says something like this of, he said They'll be in a hospital, like next to, to the person, there'll be a little thing going like, do, 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 basically like a wave. And the moment that wave goes flat straight like this, the person is gone. The moment that wave stops like this, straight, the person is gone. So we cannot live with the expectations of just being stagnant in life. Ah, no, I just want an average car or I just want to, you know, get a nine to five and just get married and have children. Look, when you feel within yourself that I should be doing this and that, you have to follow through. Otherwise, you're going to regret it. You're not going to fulfill your potential. Hey. I'm out of here. You know, there are American heroes who don't like this idea. Neil Armstrong, Gene Cernan have both testified against 